Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, L A G Snow. We here, and you know, last time we were up on the mountain. This time I'm settled down. We have done a lot of stuff around here. This world is becoming very successful. There's my friend Cindy's house over there. There's Ryan's house. Uh, Caleb's house is all the way in the distance over there. And this is my house. It's a little too gray. That's my horsey. I like him. He just spawned in my backyard and I tamed him. Um, my house, it still needs to have some more stuff to it. But I feel like it's... A pretty solid house for a beginner house we're gonna be mining today as always but i just want to give you guys a little show of what's been going on i have lots of stuff that i have been doing i got some clay we found another mess of biome but that's always beautiful i'm gonna take some of that for when we go mining i'll show you guys ryan's house we got a little boat dispenser right here just to make traveling easier for everyone here even though it's just at my house we have tons of well we travel a ton by boats uh ryan is working on an underground pathway from my house to his house did i kick the boat back out um uh, we're not gonna worry about it that's cindy's dog i don't know why she left it here you know, I'm gonna roam through- oh, he has a bunch of pigs. I'm gonna roam through his stuff just because we can. I like your house, Cindy. Yes, I know it said Sid, but she gets called Cindy. I really like his checkered uh, stairs, and this is where he's gonna start a farm. I hope that doesn't destroy it. Okay, cool. This is where he's gonna start his farm at. All the way on top of his house. And I'm gonna see if I can- possibly see the mess of biome from back here okay if you guys are looking look right there when I'm turned to the side you can see the red the red sand yeah there's a mess of biome that we oh I don't want to trouble his stuff that we have that's Cindy's house I'm gonna go get a boat show you her house and I'll finally show you guys Caleb's house that way we can see what everyone's been up to. Not many other people have played on this world to have built things yet. I really do want to get like a community involved in this. We can't do another hub sadly, so we're going to have to actually make sort of a transportation. And she's uh, been working on building a dock, which will help out with storing all these boats. I actually really like the layout of her house so far, how it just comes upstairs and then it's going to branch off in multiple directions. Very nice, very nice. Alright, and now we get to go visit my boy Caleb. But first, you know, we gotta grab this boat. Caleb lives all the way on top of the hill. Honestly, he has a really good spot if it just didn't have ice near it. Other than that, I think it's a pretty well spot. I think this world's going to come out phenomenally. I've been playing a lot on it recently. I just haven't been recording much of it. It's because I'm just thinking to myself, what is there to record? I'm always trying to get ideas. Next episode, I plan on doing a bunch of redstone stuff. I haven't worked with redstone in forever. So I feel like this is a great opportunity to start working with redstone. Make some automatic farms. Caleb has found over five spawners down in his cave right in front of his house. I actually haven't checked on his house ever since he started putting the frame up. Oh, I can't smell the cup of tea. Don't worry, I knew that. But he found a skeleton spawner and like three or four zombie spawners. None of them near the surface, but all of them in front of his house, meaning he has easy access to it. Meaning if I just make a minecart track or something to his house, everyone's going to be able to have it. I wish he lived closer to the community where we live, but everything's just kosher. It doesn't matter. Because, you know, it'd be like that sometimes. 
in our nose. That was incorrect grammar. But okay. It's okay. Let's see. Ooh. Maybe he's going to put glowstone right there. I don't like how he has a torch on any side. Does he have a torch in here? No. He does have a compass to make another map. Oh, he has an upstairs. Oh, so he's going to expand on top of this house. Okay, I got it. Then he has this wee tiny farm right here. Uh, look at this view, guys. This view right here is amazing. I thought about living right down there. But the problem was this part right here. All that snow. Oh, I have jungle samples on me? Okay. I didn't really didn't want that on me. But we'll go back, put that away, and then we'll go get mining after I show you guys the village that we have. This map is a pretty nice map, I say. I, I did show the sea when we first did a live stream on it. And so I'm thinking that you guys, I can show it again in later videos if you guys still want to see for it. It's a really cool map. I like it a lot. It's not too hectic, but at the same time, it's not too busy. Wait, hectic and busy are the same thing. Come on, Snowy. Dang. It's not too uh, simplistic. If you guys know what I'm saying. Like, there's a lot of waterways, which personally I love. I love building houses by the water. Oh, someone got fancy here. Built a bridge? Who's trying to live here? Oh wait, we're by Cindy's house, aren't we? Yep, we gotta be by her house. I'm thinking we're by her- Okay, yeah. There it is, right there. I need to make a, another map for uh, the section that we live on. And yeah, you can take this boat all the way to the other island. And this be right here. Look at this. That house just looks so pretty, it just needs more decoration near the top middle where that uh, little overhang is. That's where it needs more decoration at, and then everything's going to be just fine with it. I think the house is going to look fairly nice. And it's just something nice, you know? Yeah. So let me put these saplings up. And then we can go visit... I'll pick up that seed earlier. Then we can go visit the farm I found. Farm village. Gosh, come on, Snowy. It'll be nighttime when we get there. Fantastic. Put the jungle fountains in there. Now we got 10 of them. I did go to the jungle. Got a bunch of jungle wood. Just for our purposes of using it for sticks because I never use jungle wood. Ever. It's not that it's ugly, it's just that it's not my personal favorite test. Did that say map? Okay, I thought it said map 10. Um, we can take a bit with this, but that's gonna take up inventory space. Okay, guys, so we're in the village, and I trapped this guy in here because he has a decent tree. He has this. Infinity one book bus for 13 emeralds. You can get that so much cheaper But I come down like I'm over here. I'm listening to the voices. I'm like are they inside this house? Nope Guess where they are Right under here. This one Depth Strider 3 25 emeralds. Oh my gosh, and he has a 32 paper tray What do we have? 22 coal for an emerald uh, String. I might have to just block this guy off right here. That way, I'll never lose him. Alright, well, this was the village. Now, time to go mining. Oh, also, if you were wondering what was inside the chest, it was just iron pants, uh, three obsidian, and an iron sword. So, you know, not the best stuff that you can get, but we'll take it. Oh, wait, let's look at this guy's trade first. What's your trade? 
Uh, 35 papers, then. He's a bad villager. Very bad. Wait, blacksmith? Yeah, ho ho. What was the first one? 21 for one, yeah. Alright. Got a blast! Guys, have you ever wondered what makes Minecraft so beautiful? You see, this is what makes Minecraft beautiful right here. Look at how the formation of the block of water just stays in one spot. Look at that. Beautiful. Alright, let's go through this. Oh, a skeleton already. Fantastic. Multiple entrances. Grass down here where there's not supposed to be grass. Fantastic. So I'm definitely going to be taking iron while I was playing. One of my friends actually took some of my iron. Like, come on now. Uh, I don't like this situation. Two creepers, skeletons, zombies across. They're all trying to pass by to me. Where's the zombie going? Okay, let me get rid of the skeleton first because he's a marksman. Oh, he's oozing. Put him in phase two. Oh, okay. I think it should be safe to go down now. For the most part. Zombie wars again. What are you doing, man? Okay. If you wanna just commit Sudoku, it's okay with me. It was either my turn or yours. Oh, what? Come on out. You guys saw that strength. Nerf skeletons 2016, please. Uh, I know I saw a bunch of materials back there. I just like posting up, going to like the ends of things. That way everything's split up. You don't give them a chance to spawn in. You gotta think this stuff too. And yes, I did kill rabbits. No, I do not have any shame in it. No, I did not get a rabbit's foot. Yes, I am sad. I answered multiple questions at once. You're welcome. You are welcome. Dun 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 dun. dun. And yeah, for the next episode, we're probably gonna be building. We need to find the end dragon and stuff like that, the ender portal. But at the same time, we also just need to uh, go to the Nether, get some XP farms going, get some enchanting going, get some diamonds going. I'm ranked. I'm level 29. Still have no way of enchanting. Kind of sad, even if we did have the enchanting table, I wouldn't be able to enchant because we don't have enough books. So there's just a bunch of stuff we need to work on in this world, which is always great. It's always fun having a fresh start in Minecraft. That's just something that never gets old, having that fresh start, not knowing what to do, but having the ideas come to you. I can't jump right there. Uh -huh, it's going to be snowy. Got a block over your head. I know, I know, I know. Calm down. Calm down, mate. We don't want to go up. But we gonna light it up. I hear a skeleton. Okay, that's a... That's a drop-off. Are you above me? I feel like he's above me. So, I am not going to take all the materials in this cave. Just because if I were to do that... Let's just say I'd be here for a very long time. Especially with just an iron pick. So we're going to uh, do this my way. Uh, 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 uh. Hurry up. Jungle. Sticks. Torches. There we go. We're Gucci fam. Man, that drops down. A good ways. Okay, I'm, I'm liking this cave. <coughs> Let's see, anything over here? Anything at all? Another open. No, 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 no. <laughs> what is this hit detection, man? 
You guys saw how many times I swung in the general facility of that guy? You're gonna tell me that didn't connect any of those? Why am I going up? That's lava. Yeah, I mean. Yep. That's a full of lava, meaning there's diamonds nearby. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. Let's go grab the diamonds. Guaranteed. Diamonds guaranteed. 100%. Well, it does, Nelly. You're like in an open spot and you can see the wall. Oh, yep. Oh! <laughs> I was marveling in how smart the witch was. Ah, uh, how good did she get me? Okay, not too good. Still, nice armor. Also, that witch is very smart. Potions of fire resistance. That was just a smart move. I, I can't even get upset about that. I was just like, ah, oh, you're burning, but then I was like, oh wait, they can drink their own potions. Stupid witches. We need gold, yes, we need gold. And we need this stuff right here. This beautiful stuff. Yes, we're gonna need it for multiple projects in the future. Too bad I don't have silk touch, so I can save it for my fortune pick whenever I get that. Oh, I felt like something was in that wall. There's no point in going up. No point at all. Also, they need to add something where you can hold down the touchpad to see what level you're on. Stuff like that. Instead of having to carry a map on you for it, because that's taking up inventory space. And no one likes taking up their inventory space. Oh, I don't have a bow. Oh, that's really annoying. You see me? I hope not. I'm not sure she sees me, she just can't reach me. Here is all me. Oh, I don't really don't like this position. Auto save is on. Because we don't cheat. Okay, so if I place a water bucket right here, that should create some land for her. And now we have to attack, and you're not on land, and... Die, man! Oh, goodness gracious. Oh my gosh, what was that, instant damage too? What up, fam? We're gonna have to chill out next to the zombie for a while. Alright, so, uh... <laughs> I'll be right back. Okay, so good news is that the witch is gone. It went away because, uh... I'm 99% sure his fire resistant potion ran off and... Since it was already weak from us hitting it so many times, it just died like that. But at the same time, man... Witches are something you do not want to deal with. Did you see how much damage the Poison Plus Instinct damage did on me? That's the new Wombo combo. Like, that was just insane. How much damage that actually did to me. I was going in there all confident like, thinking, oh, it's gonna be nothing. I missed the creeper. Then it turns out everything, and, uh, I'm not seeing any Diamonds down here. I said 100% guaranteed. Da 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 da. Come on now. This can't be happening to me. No, 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 no. It cannot be true. Alright. Why did I place it? Guys, don't comment about that. I wasn't thinking when I placed it down. It's like I was thinking. Look, smart. Uh, Wolfram. I hear a skeleton. It jumped in the water. Yep. 
Yo, this is a nice vein of gold. Are you gonna shoot me now? I heard it like arch his boob. Fire? Alright, you're dead. Just in peace. Sis. A little bone. Piece of bone. You. Da 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 da. Alright. Now, let's see how much iron we can get. This is really good. Because I'm probably going to end up using iron for my beacon. Unless I make a gold farm. Let's see. What we can do. There's no point of going up, man. Ah, oh, this cave just might be dead. Let's go see if we can find anything else. Oh my gosh! Oh my heart. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> Alright guys, well, I was, unfortunately, I wasn't able to find any diamonds down there, but we got a ton of iron, some redstone, so we can start working on some redstone projects, some gold, because, you know, we're gonna need those golden apples if we're gonna face the weather, and a bunch of coal, because I've been smelting a lot of stuff, and a lot of stuff needs to get smelt. Alright, well, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy that fail. Listen, we don't talk about that fail. Oh, did I? My fault. We don't talk about what happened in that fail. But what should... Give a name for this horse. I think I might name him Horsey. Nah, I'm gonna name him Jumpy. He can jump by uh, three blocks. Let me show you guys that real quick. Oh, I don't want to use cobble because my thing's about to break. Oh, is there something light I have on me? No. Oh. Yep, three logs. Thank you guys so much for watching. And until then, I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.